High pressure continues to dominate Ohio's weather this Tuesday, the first day of August, the, the very last month of climatological summer, May, June, or actually June, July, and August are climatological summer. And then September, October, and November is climatological fall. We'll get into more of that later. High pressure located across the eastern U.S. is continuing to pump warm, muggy air into the Ohio Valley. You can see a system out here to the west that is uh, trying to make its way to the southeast, but it's not having any luck because of the strength of the high pressure system. It'll remain fairly much parked out there until Thursday, and at that point in time, high pressure will ease its grip on the Ohio Valley, and this critter will make its way to the southeast threatening us with an increasing chance of shower and thunderstorm activity Thursday night and especially into the day on Friday. Now, there are a chance of thunderstorms just about every day until Saturday. That's because of the instability with the humidity and the heat and the atmosphere when you get the afternoon convection, the heat and the thermals rise off the ground into the atmosphere. And if there's a trigger up there, they'll form a storm. Local map shows temperatures this Tuesday morning in the upper 50s to near 70 degrees down here in southwest Ohio near Cincinnati. A gorgeous morning, some fog located along the Ohio River valleys, the Tuscarawas River, Muskingum Rivers, every waterway that there is has a little bit of fog this morning. Your travelers forecast on the day Wednesday. Looks like this. For the most part, partly to mostly sunny skies expected, but there is a chance of an afternoon thunderstorm that's why we have it up here, a thunderstorm possible. Yes, just about anywhere in the state of Ohio, so don't be surprised if you encounter one. If they stay parked, you're gonna get a lot of rain. Will that cold front hang around through the weekend and give us a very wet weekend? Well, the answer to that is on your local National Weather Service five-day forecast. So there you have it, Wednesday, Thursday, and especially Friday has the best chance of thunderstorm activity as that front makes its, through, its way through here. But the weekend right now looks to be much cooler, much less humid, and a itsy bitsy little preview of autumn. Yep, looks that way. Have yourselves a great day.